Hello, and welcome back to another video. My name is Jake the Genealogist, and in today's video, we're going to be doing the second installment, and actually the last installment, of this East African Monarchs family tree chart. And um, in today's video, we're going to be going over the Kabakas of Uganda, which is, and you guessed it, the nation of Uganda. Now, um, so we're going to be starting right now. So, um... Right here, um, we start with um, Naki Binge, who's not actually the first uh, Kabaka of Bugan. There are those earlier ones in the 1400s and the 1400s, but um, couldn't really fit them on this chart. So we start with him. He had three different wives that are kind of important to us. That is Najemba, Namulondo, and Nasuna. And um, with each of them, he had a child who became a monarch, and those were Mulondo, Jemba, and Suna, and they all became um, Kabakas in turn as well. And um, Suna had a child whose name was Kimbugwe Kamagere, which ruled from around 1644 to around 1644. And Mulondo also had a child who became. Uh, monarch that was Sem Sekamanya. That's a hard one to pronounce. And he uh, actually ruled before his, I guess, half cousin Kimbugwe. And um, in turn, Sekamanya had a child named Katarega, and he ruled for around thirty years. And then he had three children, all with the same wife, Namutebe. And those were Mutebe the first, Yuko, and Kayemba. Uh, Mutebe had a child named Tebandeke, and Yuko also had a child uh, named Ndawula, um, who I guess had some kind of overlapping roles. And then um, Ndawula also had three wives, and those were Naguja, Nakedeluiga, and Naki Kulwe, and with Naguja he had um, Kagulen Tambe Tebuki Wereke. <laughs> Man, these are hard. And uh, he ruled for around two years before passing it to his uh, half brother Kikulwe Mauba, who also ruled for two years, and then passing it to his half brother Mawanda Sabanakita, who ruled for again, two years, and, um, then, um, it goes through his brother, who I believe is dead at that point, I'm not exactly sure, but it went through his brother, Prince Musanje Goluba, his wife was Nabulia, Nalugwa, and they had three children, named, um, Mwanga the first, Namugala, Kagali, and Kiabagu, Kabinuli, um, and neither of these two had any kids, so it goes through him and his wife, Nanteza, down to their two kids named Kunyu and Semakukiro. Um, the line further passes down for him and his wife, Nansi Kom, Ndawadewazidwa. That one's probably the hardest one on this tree. Um, and to their son, Kamanya Kaduwamala, um, and his wife, Nakazi Kanyange, down to their kid, Suna II, Kalema Kasinjo, and his wife, Muganzir Waza, and then finally down to someone who I have a picture of, and that is Mutisa the first Mukabia, and uh, he ruled from 1856 to 1884. He also had three wives, like uh, many of the other ones, and with those three wives, he bore three children. That was Mwanga II, Nyonyetono Kawiwa, and Kalema Muguluma. Um, and so this guy, Mwanga II, um, he ruled for four years until getting, I believe, deposed or something in favor of his half brother. Kiwiwa, and um, then in turn his other brother Kalema, and then he returned to the throne for another eight years before actually getting deposed again, and he actually eventually died in exile in 
the island nation of the Seychelles, I believe. His wife was Evelyn Kulabako, and they had a child named Doughty Tua the second, who ruled for a pretty nice um, 42 years, which is longer than most of these ones. And um, he married Irene Namaganda. He had a child named Luangula Mutisa the second, who ruled for 30 years. Up until 1969, his wife was Sarah Kisonkoli. And then after that, by 1969, like a lot of these other monarchies, like these two that both ended in the 60s as well, the monarchy actually stopped by then, and they actually converted to a republic and had um, presidents or prime ministers, um, just like these, um, just like Rwanda and Burundi. But then in 1993, his son, Mwanda Muteba II, actually inherited the throne, and in 1993, he was officially crowned as the Kamaka of Uganda, and he's been there up to the current day. He's the current um, one in Uganda. He's actually the only one out of these three monarchies that is still uh, serving as a monarch, and um, the only monarch on here that's obviously still alive, unless you want to count um, that questionable Yuki the Sixth from over here that I mentioned in the last video. So that was basically everything today. I hope you enjoyed this quick video. I'm gonna be coming out with one either tomorrow or the next day to kind of make up for the short one. But I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys all later. Goodbye. Also. One more thing, um, if you want to get this um, certain chart for yourself, then I'll post a link in the description with a PDF for downloading this, and I hope you guys all enjoy this video. Catch you all later. Goodbye.